Welcome to Software Inc, folks. We are starting a brand new playthrough today in Software Inc, obviously. And we are starting our own little uh, software company. It's a startup. Our name is Johnny Doe. This is what we look like. Very handsome. And our company is going to be NerdySoft. We are playing on hard mode. Uh, we have 10,000 in starting funds, and that's it. Uh, no loan. And... Our guy uh, knows nothing about service. Absolutely nothing. He basically, to him, service means the customer is never right. So, yeah, very service minded guy. Um, in development, we have some skills here. We have designer, programmer, and artist. And I have selected uh, two stars in system design, two stars in 2D, and one star in audio. The same for our programming skills. And for the artist skills, we have two stars in 2D and one star in audio. In leader skills, uh, this is how well we are able to manage a team. We have one star in HR handle complaints and salaries. We can't do education. We can't do hiring, uh, though we can, but uh, I'll be doing that manually so he doesn't need to do it right now anyway. We, we will uh, level up as we play along. And then we have some automation skills here, so we can do project management. We can do SQLs, iterations, and frameworks, but we can't handle post-release tasks. Uh, we have socialization, we can uh, boost team compatibility, we can socialize with employees, but we can't hold meetings yet. Uh, for multitasking, we can improve effectiveness with support and marketing tasks. Uh, we can improve effectiveness with development tasks, but we can't uh, improve effectiveness with all tasks just yet. Uh, for service, we are really good at support, uh, but we don't do marketing, we don't do law. And so yeah, that's our setup. We have some buildings here that we can choose from. We could choose an empty plot to start with, but no, it's too expensive, $50,000. $50, we only have 10. So we can start in the garage, the apartment, or the skyscraper. We're going to start out in the garage because we're just going to be ourselves in the beginning here. Uh, and the apartment and the skyscraper are a little bit more expensive. Uh, also a little bit more spacious, but we don't need space for just me. So let's jump in to the garage. Uh... Disable all tutorials. I don't want tutorials on. I have played the game quite a bit. Uh, I have around 100 hours in it. And I don't feel like I need tutorials, though it has been a long time since I played the game. Uh, but Alpha 11 uh, came out uh, a while ago, and I actually really I really wanted to play it, play it for a while. Uh, but then I was watching someone else play on YouTube, and I really got an itch uh, to play uh, so software ink here. So that's what we're doing. All right. First off, we need some furniture for our office here, our little garage office. That's it, and a toilet. Uh, at least we have an ensuite toilet. Uh, so that's a good thing. Uh, so let's see. What do we want? I think we want a glass table and another one like that. Then we want a chair. Uh, we're going to give ourselves an executive chair. It's a little bit more comfy and we are going to be spending a lot of time here. We need a computer, obviously. Uh, then we need What's that hollow computer? I don't think we can get that yet in 1980. Um, let's get... Uh, hmm. Let's get a floor lamp here. And... We'll get ourselves a little table plant. Like that. And I want a calculator because we'll be doing a lot of programming. So let's give ourselves a calculator here as well. We'll put a little plant in here. 
and we'll put a uh, bookshelf in as well which gives a little boost to skills and uh, makes the environment a little bit nicer we do need some light in here of course so let's do that we'll stick two lamps in here i think maybe not up there though uh that's uh that let's just stick it down here two lights down here because we have the floor lamp there okay and i think that's all we need really right now uh let's get a clock as well so we can see how many hours we're working how productive we are and a little uh, painting there over there as well to sweeten up the environment a little bit so yeah cool we have ourselves an office now now that that's done we need to first of all we need to get to work so let's uh, do that we're at work so Let's see, we need to get a contract. Now we could start developing our own software, but we just don't have the money for it. It'll take way too long. The, uh, the, there are all different kinds of software we can develop, and of course games, and there are several different uh, genres of games. Uh, but if we take something as simple, uh, I think the antivirus is probably the most simple. It will take less than a year, but we have absolutely no uh, uh, functions in there so if we put them on then it'll say approximately two years and we need three designers and four programmers if we just put one thing on there we actually need two designers and two programmers and the expected interest is only 16 percent so yeah we, we're not uh, doing that we need to do some contract work to kick, kick things off get a bit of money uh, so that we can hire another dude and then we can start uh, working on our own stuff so let's see one uh, designer one pro programmer uh, system any level good that's us and the expected quality is bad and we have one month to do it so one month is one day uh, in this uh, scenario so let's uh, accept this work uh, I do want to manage my team here and say we not, we're not going home until 6 o'clock. So we're working from 8 to 6. Uh, I think that's a reasonable. Our guy doesn't really have any needs, doesn't need food, doesn't need rest, anything like that. He is just a monster sitting there at the computer working like a maniac. Uh, so that is, is what we're doing. And let's go ahead and start so worth noting here we, we can see over here that we have our first iteration of this going you can go up to four iterations in the design phase we don't need to do that but the more iterations you have it they impact uh, the potential quality uh, of the software and how many bugs there will be in the software but i think we're okay to develop this they wanted bad quality we can do bad quality so let's develop that let's speed up time a bit and there we go we have made enough code so let's promote it uh, the blue line here indicates how much code we need to do to satisfy their needs so yes uh, let's go ahead and do that and fix like three bugs finish uh, and let's take a look here. Contract fulfilled for a net worth of 10,242 with outstanding quality. So that's all we needed to do. And it's only 10, well, 11 o'clock in the morning. And we've already made our 10, first 10,000. Pretty sweet. Let's grab another contract. Uh, embedded system, uh, system development. And they want mediocre uh, quality. And there's a feature of a clock. Wow. Very cool, very cool. Let's accept that work and go ahead and start the first iteration, iteration of that. Can be a little bit difficult to see here. Let's go ahead and develop. And there we go. Let's promote it. Uh, I'm sure you want to promote out of alpha phase. Uh, yes, don't ask again. And we're fixing a few bugs here. Finish. 
satisfactory quality. Perfect. Another 10 grand in the bank. Uh, do we have time to do another one? I think we do, probably. So let's grab another embedded system. Uh, they want a clock as well. Their expected quality is horrible. <laughs> uh, minimum progress is 20.9%. And sure, we'll uh, accept that work. Go ahead. And I want to be able to see. So let's iterate. Do the first iteration here. Uh, develop. And where are we going? Oh, uh, fair enough. Uh, we have this month uh, as well to, to finish this. So uh, let's promote it and let's finish it. Pause, another contract fulfilled, outstanding quality, another 10 grand in the bank. So we now have 37,261. Yay. All right. Let's do some more contract work. We, we need to save up quite a bit. Uh, so let's see income. Game assets, that requires art. And we, we can't do art, uh, but uh, let's look at income here. So logistics application, expected quality bad, accept that. And we'll sec accept uh, this guy as well at the same time. We can work on two things at the same time. We are incredibly talented. And our first iteration is going here. And develop, develop. And this guy is going fast. Uh, promote you, promote you, fix a few bugs. Uh, finish, finish. And inadequate, inadequate. We still made decent money. They didn't expect great quality, so all good. It's only two o'clock. We're staying here until six. So I think we can do one more. Uh, let's do this logistics application. Accept work. Go. Develop. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, we need to uh, go through at least one iteration here, I think. There we go. Develop. And promote. And finish. There we go, 8,000, outstanding quality. We can start on the next one. Let's start on this uh, embedded system, accept, uh, go, go. Uh, we can, uh, let's just go there, develop. When we arrive at work in the morning, we are good to go, we're coding. Promoting, finishing, outstanding quality. Let's pause for a second. We now have 70,000, which is pretty damn sweet. If we take a look at our finances, we have expenses of 380 a month, but we've been making pretty decent money, pretty decent money. So 23,000. 35,000 we made, and we've already made 5,000 uh, this month, almost six. So yeah, we, we're doing good. We're doing good. The question is, do we want to hire someone already? And maybe have that someone do a bit of contract work as well? I don't think so. Let's, let's just do contract work uh, ourselves up until uh, June or July or something. We could, uh, we could deposit some money in the bank to make interest. The problem is that we can't withdraw it again anytime soon if we do. You know what, we're gonna do it, deposit, and we can withdraw it in April, 1981. So it needs to, to stay in there for a year, but we'll ma be making interest every month from it. Good. Uh, let's get some more contracts. Uh, logistics application, accept. Uh, then there's only game assets. Mm, okay. We'll accept that as well. Uh, go, go. 
Taofang sausage. What kind of name is that? And chicken corp. <laughs> uh, let's develop and develop. And the game assets here are, I think, let's uh, promote and promote. Fix. Uh, there's no bugs to fix there. Outstanding quality. Finish. Outstanding quality. Very cool. Uh, now, we are up to a two-star business reputation, which is pretty good. Uh, each star affects the quality of the employees that we can get. And also, we can get subsidiaries when we get a little bit further into the game, uh, which is cool. So we can have subsidiary uh, companies. Very, very cool. And we have a very good reputation in contracts. So let's get some more contracts, shall we? Game asset, accept work, game assets, accept work. Go. Get it done, dude. Get it done. Make that cash. All right. Let's develop and develop. And we have done the art that we need. Promote, finish, promote, and inadequate quality. Yeah. It's not great, but it's fine. It's fine. Uh, no bugs to fix. Finish, uh, pause. So inadequate quality. That's fine. And basically, we're going to do this uh, for a little while. We now have way better contracts uh, well contracts that we make way more money on but they also need more stuff and this one for two months will actually make us 44 grand but we make recommended designers two programmers two or artist one and the time limit is two months so i think we'll just stick with Something a little bit easier. Mm. We have a month to do this one. Let's try accepting that. And speed on time here. And we can see that it's taking a lot longer to design now, it looks like. So we might only be able to do one per month now, but that's okay. That's okay. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Develop. And we're coding and we're arting. Uh, let's speed up here. And promote. And we're fixing bugs. Finish. And inadequate quality. We made 13,000 though. So that's just fine. And we have 61,000 in the bank again. Very cool. Now let's take a look at uh, money here. So we are making money. We are getting interest on our money that we deposited. So if we take a look at this, we have accrued $165 in interest. Woohoo! Very, very nice. We are we're doing it, guys. We're making money. Do we want to deposit some more or do we want to hire someone? I think we want to hire someone. And I also think we want uh, to call cleaning and IT support to get in here. And because it's looking a little bit shabby in here. But let's hire some other person, maybe, and just have that person doing contracts as well, I think, uh, for now. I save up around, I don't know, 200,000 or something so that we can start working on our own bit of software. So let's do it. Uh, we have a reward. Make 50,000 from contracts. Claim that reward. What is it? What is it? This is new. Wow! No! I accidentally clicked. What was it? 
I didn't see what the reward was. <laughs> well, that's too bad. I really wanted to see what that reward was. I have never seen rewards before. This is brand new. Very cool. I wish I knew what it was, though. Oh, we can see here we have new furniture. Um, What's new? Oh, it's these things. Ergonomic chair. And a yoga ball. Cool. I like it. I like it a lot. All right, well, let's get another person in here and do some work for us. He's definitely not getting that chair. Uh, you can get an executive chair. Like us, we treat our employees well. And there, and I think we probably need, now let's get the last table. We probably need, oh, he gets a, um, let's see. So the inbox here gives some bonuses to lead, a little bit to designer and service. This is made, mainly programmer, a lot for the artist on the drawing tablet and a lot for the service there. I think, Hmm. Let's let's do the uh, the calculator. And oh, uh, one thing that we also do want is uh, uh, let's see reception utility. Uh, no. Uh, bathroom, kitchen, uh, common. I think it's under. Uh, no, it's not. Canteen. There we go. We need a coffee machine, I think. So let's get an espresso machine in here. And over in the other corner, we'll get... Another table, and for the canteen, we'll get a mini fridge so that our employee can have some, uh, bring some uh, some food, a lunchbox uh, uh, to work. Very cool. I do want, um, where is, there's supposed to be a fire alarm somewhere. Not in the bathroom. Uh, function. Uh, security. Fire alarm. That's what we wanted. There we go. And we should get a security camera as well. Oh. Uh, uh. Hmm. All right, fine. Um, move that. Stick it over there. Still no one can reach it. All right, all right. Let's move this over here. There we go. There we go. All right. Then all we need to do is hire an employee. Uh, we want a programmer with, I think, system specialization. Low salary is fine. Um, and we'll spend, let's spend 1400 on that. Begin looking. We want someone who is very, very compatible with us. Every porter here uh, has... A little bit of skill in programming and an artist. Uh, no, nah, not really. Uh, but he does have some 2D, system 2D and audio programming skills. So, yeah, I think uh, you're hired. Um, 
Why is this so small? Uh, let's hire you. Yes, I'm sure. I'm sure I want to hire Avery. And Avery will be at work tomorrow, not today, unfortunately. Oh, a new reward. Uh, hire your first employee. Claim reward. All right, let's see what this reward is. A desk and a modern desk. Very nice. I like it. I like this new th stuff. Cool. All right. So, uh, tomorrow, in the game, we'll have Avery coming in, and we'll be able to do more contracts. Let's uh, select a contract here. Um, yeah, I suppose that's fine. Uh, let's do this one. The expected quality is bad. Uh, let, let's let's do this one. It's a little bit more money. Go ahead. Move time on. And office is nice and clean for when our first employee shows up. Let's develop. And go, go, go. The chicken stop. Uh, let's promote it. And finish it. Satisfactory quality. Wonderful. And we now have 69,000, 70,000. So yeah, uh, pretty good start, I think. We have our business reputation up reasonably. We're making monthly profits. We have our first employee coming in today. And I think that's a good time to end this episode. So I hope you're enjoying uh, Software Inc. so far. I know it's very basic so far, but it gets real complex and a heck of a lot of fun. So yeah, just wait and see. If you haven't watched Software Inc. and you haven't played Software Inc., then you're in for a treat because it is really, really cool. So uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not hit leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.